I'm very impressed how you started your collaboration with Dr. Daudner in the conference. So I wonder if you have any advice for young scientists for networking during conference. Conferences are a very good way because mm -hmm. In a way, at conferences, you have the chance to really see and interact, yeah. uh, you know, with, uh, with scientists. Mm -hmm. And you have the possibility to test uh, whether, you know, there is a chemistry or not. First of all, I think it's important to, to discuss with as many people as, as possible, mm -hmm. as many scientists as possible. I see when uh, you have the poster presentation, it's a very good um, frame yes, to yes. meet people. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, you don't know exactly what type of interactions you're mm -hmm. going to have with a scientist yeah. at a poster, mm -hmm. and you realize that actually you may have, uh, uh, you know, a, a more um, fruitful interaction than what mm -hmm. you were mm -hmm. expecting initially. And then it's also critical to try to to go to the people with mm -hmm. whom you think you could potentially collaborate or mm -hmm. you could discuss your project and could mm -hmm. uh, help you, provide you some insights. I see, I see. Do you usually like identify someone that might be interesting for you to yeah. talk to you? Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rather than randomly yeah. just talk to people? As well. Mm. Because as I said, you can yeah. be surprised yeah. sometimes That's with cool. the type of conversation that mm -hmm. you may have. So it's important to not be shy and to uh, force uh, <laughs> the social skills, yeah. if possible. Yeah, that's important. Thing. Mm -hmm.